Today I want to talk about aligning and positioning your controls on a form. Anyone who's worked in uh, a form and access or uh, any kind of form grid uh, in any other program for that matter, you know the trials and tribulations of trying to eyeball uh, your controls and try to align them up right and get all these things right and you know positioning them and scrunching them down and doing all the things that you'd have to do manually. Now you can't get rid of this whole process altogether but there are some tools and access that allow you to do some some of these things a lot easier um, and I'll talk about them today. When you're in design view if you right click on any one of these controls you'll see two options align and size and you'll have some of these uh, menu selections here that are disabled. Every control has these options. Now the idea is that if you select a group of controls and you right click on that uh, group you'll enable these selections here and then what you can do is you can apply some of these rules to that group so for example align right if I click on that uh, you'll notice that these two um, boxes will have the same alignment on the right and now, now notice that this text box and this text box are different sizes and I want to make the year uh, as wide as the expiration date so if I group these two together and right click and I can go to size to the widest and now these two text boxes are the same size and now I can align right so now let's go ahead and do all these I'm gonna go ahead and align right size widest align left so now a very in cut four clicks I actually made them the, the all the same size and um, I've aligned them to the left without burning my eyeballs out and for these labels I can cut these out and then paste them back on now I can move them anywhere I want independent of the text boxes and again I want to align left size to the widest and now they're all size to the widest now I can take these two and ensure that they match each other by aligning to the top year align to the top same thing for serial number and the rest of them so now what I can do is I can make sure that they all uh, are the same size height wise so I can go ahead and do size to the shortest make sure that they're all the size, same size there now I can select the whole thing and say align to the top and now they're all scrunched in together and now I can manually highlight them all and size them the way I want to and kind of drag them in so now I've got this great way to quickly produce a form that's even and um, positioned correctly with very little work at all. There's a lot of combinations here so go ahead and try it out and uh, I'm sure it'll save you tons of time.